guys, today we're going to do uh, the rocking chair, and from the rocking chair to the samurai walk, alright? So the rocking chair is a great way to um, warm up, also it's a great way to learn to curve your spine, protect your chin, also it's a great uh, self-defense move because it teaches you to walk backwards safely and your feet are in a proper position to counter attack. It's a great way to um, come forward, it's a great way to fall backwards and do butterfly sweep, alright? So the walk, uh, rocking chair looks like this, where you're falling back, uh, where you're falling backwards, and you're coming back up, and then you're coming back. Alright, two more times. Now obviously I'm stylizing it because I want to open up my hip, I want to stretch it out, I'm stylizing it because I want to uh, get a nice stretch on my ankle. Okay, back. Alright, I'm also stylizing it because I want to learn to extend my chest. So I don't want to make sure my body's down, I want to make sure it's up. And I'm going to twist my thumb so it's downward. Alright, back. Alright, one more time. Alright, okay, guys, now we're going to do a rocking chair to samurai walk. So it looks like this. One, two. Alright, from here you're going to switch sides right away. One, two, right away. Alright, now really important, once you're here, you want to think about rotating and not dragging your knee. So in other words, don't do this and then fall back. Okay, nothing wrong with that, it's just, it's not as efficient. So you're going here, you don't want to do this. You want to think about just turning back right away. Okay, boom. So, 